Hey guys, school's back in, so we're going to talk about three ways to make money in middle school. Stay tuned. So when you're in middle school, you really can't get a job, and you could do a lot of other little odd-end jobs, which we'll talk about later in this video. But if you can get started making an online business now, you may never have to get a job again. While your friends are all flipping burgers at a fast food restaurant, you're gonna be making money online and living the lifestyle you want. So I've actually created a guide on how to make money with your own website at my website, howtomakemoneyasakid.com. I'll put a link in the description below. But on a website, what you can do is you can create a, a blog or a niche website about a certain topic. And then um, as you write content, create videos, people will come to your site and then you can put ads on it, put affiliate links like selling other pe people's products, or you can even create your own products like writing your own eBooks or making courses, different things like that. So starting a website is an awesome way. Now, or you could start a YouTube channel. So if you would feel more comfortable in front of the camera instead of writing, maybe a YouTube channel is a better idea for you. But if you do have a YouTube channel, you might also want a website just so you can direct people back to your website to actually sell stuff. But you can make money on YouTube through ads, through working with brands and brand deals, and uh, doing sponsorships, promotions, that kind of thing. And you can sell products on, on YouTube as well and do affiliate links. So um, YouTube's nice, doesn't have any startup costs like a website does, but you don't have a website, you have 100% control. Now the other idea is starting an Instagram account. Now, if you're awesome at taking pictures and you love Instagram, maybe this is the right idea for you. So create an Instagram account in a niche or kind of about your personality or whatever, but you have to grow a following of, you know, five, 10,000 at least. But the bigger, the better. I know um, I've actually done some consulting for a business who had like 180,000 followers on Instagram and they sold little baby shoes. And this company made enough money from their 180,000 followers on Instagram for her husband, who was a lawyer, to quit his job and work full time in the business. So there's a lot of money to be made on Instagram. And you can do that through brand deals, um, promotions. You can direct people to your website and sell products that you've created or something like that. Um, there's, there's really a lot of ways you can make money by growing an Instagram account. So that's my favorite idea for making money in middle school, is actually making money online, starting a business. Because it might take you a couple years, but guess what? In a couple years, you'll be making passive income. You won't have to clock in, you won't have to go mow someone's lawn. You'll be making money online while you sleep, which is an awesome thing. Okay, so idea number two. Now, this is something to do while you're actually in school. You have to actually be careful because you can get in trouble. So you have to do this the right way. Okay. And this is what I call the backpack dollar store. So at school, kids always need something. They either need some candy, they need pencils, pens, maybe a charge for their phone, something like that. And uh, you can always have those items in your backpack. So kids can come to you and you can, you can sell. Now you can't really be shy doing this and you have to probably not do it during class. Do it during your recess breaks, during your lunch breaks, after school, on the bus, those kind of things, so you don't get in trouble. Um, but this is a great way to make a couple extra bucks. Go buy, go buy a bunch of pencils, buy some extra candy, maybe buy a phone charge. You could charge like 50 cents or something for charging someone's phone for an hour, or, or even cell phone chargers, maybe. That, that could be a good idea. Anyway, the whole idea is to um, always have that stuff on hand. You don't have to have a ton of it. You don't have to have tons of candy or whatever. And you're not going to make a ton of money doing this, but you will make a little bit of money that you can go buy lunch or do whatever you want and save it for those things you want. So always have a backpack dollar store. So always have a couple items that kids will need. You can sell those things for like 50 cents, a dollar, whatever. Just make sure you're making a profit on those items. So that's another great way. So another way to make money during school is actually make t-shirts. Now there's a, the way to do this is, I actually did this in high school, I should have made money on it, but I didn't, I was dumb, I just charged the cost of making the t-shirt. 
but um, create a club. You can create like some kind of a school club, um, like a chess club, a tennis club. We made an anti lacrosse club. Anyway, it's a long story, but um, there was these girls that started a fake lacrosse team. Um, anyway, and they would put up announcements. They do an all elaborate on it, and so we were like, "That's that's garbage. We're gonna make an anti lacrosse team." And so anyway, so we made these shirts. Um, they're bright orange, stood out. We wear them like every Friday. Anyway, we got like tons of people to join our club. And we sold tons of t-shirts. And if I would have just charged $20 instead of $15 for how much they actually cost, I could have actually made some money with that. So I have another video um, that I'll link to in the description below. But actually how to make t-shirts. Um, you can make them and you can sell them. So that's another great way to make money during school. Okay, so the third most reliable way to make money in middle school is to hustle. Now what I'm talking about is babysitting, mowing lawns, doing work for your parents, your grandparents, your neighbors, yard work, those kind of things. Um, you know, whether it's summertime, fall, winter, now right now it's fall, going into winter. Um, you know, lawns still need to be mowed right now. Pretty soon there's gonna be leaves to rake up. And after that, there's gonna be snow to shovel. So you can be that person that people just go to to get those jobs done that they don't have time for. And so well, that's a great way to make some money if you're, you know, you like to work and you know, just put on a good audio book or uh, something and you know, go work. So you're gonna have to go talk to your parents, go talk to uh, your neighbors and try to get those jobs or babysitting. Um, babysitting is a great way to make money as a, as a teenager in middle school. About 13 is like about the perfect age to start getting babysitting. And so if you're looking and wondering how to make actually do a good at babysitting or get babysitting jobs, I've actually created a course called the Babysitting Business Academy. I'll put the link in the description below. That'll teach you how to get babysitting jobs. Not really how to babysit, but how to get babysitting jobs. Because most people know how to take care of kids. You can do one of those Red Cross courses if you want to learn how to babysit. But in this course, I teach you how to get babysitting jobs. So hustle. Those are some of the those are some of the great ways to make money in middle school. So I hope this was helpful. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. We're going to be hitting up about three videos a week to try to pump out a lot of content to really help you make money. And not only make money like mowing lawns and talking about that traditional stuff, but really making money online because that's what I really am excited about. That's what I'm passionate about. That's where my full-time business is, is online. And that's where I think you should be too. And you can start now. So that's actually my goal for my kids is before they move out of my house, they're going to have an online business that creates all the income they need so they never have to get a job. They can pay for college. They can go travel the world, do whatever they want. But their online business will pay for their life. And they never have to go work nine to five unless they want to, of course. And then they can do, go ahead and do that but I'm gonna help them create their own business and I'm gonna help you do that as well. So make sure to subscribe, ask questions in the comments below for more ways um, that you have made money and go to the comments and read, see what other kids are doing and uh, we'll catch you in the next episode.